Hi fishing buddies, guys and girls! In this video you will see how I caught the trophy fish Hunter just recently on the Grand Union Canal Fishing Sim World Pro Tour. Now I was lucky there, I got a perfect strike on this fish but my tension, I got it actually set to 25 I should have had it set slightly lower because if you noticed as soon as I hit that fish my tension um, warning came on there it went right up into the red and bleeped at me I could have lost that fish I was lucky this time I had got 30 pound Ridge Monkey line on if I got anything less I may have lost the fish the hook may have dropped and it would have gone so you've got to be careful you've got to be careful on your tension there I wasn't I was lucky you were lucky there Wobbles very lucky <laughs> more on the setup later I will put the setup on the screen at the end of the video but the lure was a D-bomb desert storm Now why I'm playing this fish, this is a recording I, I did earlier um, down on the canal. I've been, you know, a lot of people are mentioning how difficult it is now um, trying to catch pike. Particularly when they see a video I did, oh it was back in t September 2018. It was, it was when the game was released. Since then it's had regular updates lots and lots of updates and um, it was very much in them days right at the beginning it was cast and catch regarding the pike down here on the canal it's not quite like that now it's a little bit more difficult it's a little bit more I'd say realistic um, so you know it's not that easy to catch the pike particularly a trophy pike like this one now you might be watching this and saying you've been a bit soft on that fish there aren't you wobbles how are you playing that well there's a reason for it they've got these pikes some of these pike are dialed in and they can fool you they, I've lost them numerous times down here and I've gone high up on the tension like now I'm going up into the 30s there on me reel thinking I've, I've got the fish and then and then it's just turned and darted <laughs> and I turn up till I've lost the fish so I try to keep it round about in the green now so I can adjust it very quickly I can lower the tension and higher the tension but I don't like going too high because I've had particularly one or two of these trophy fish and uh, pike, um, they've they've unhooked, or they say snap the line, but it's not snap the line. It's when the fish too much tension, it comes unhooked. Um, it drops the hook, pulls the hook, and we lose the fish. That's happened to me quite a few times with the pike. So you just have to be aware of that because you think you've got it, and then it just it does a runner and goes, and you've lost it. Now I always blame Des when that happens, because no doubt it was Des who, who, who put that in, I don't know, but I just blame Des. It happened to me earlier on the other side of the bridge, I lost one, I lost a pike like that, I, I got it and me, it just turned and bolted and I got 30 pound line on it, just took me tension all the way up and it unhooked, I lost the fish, I just blame Des. So with the recent updates, um, or the updates that have happened over the coming nearly year now, um, I when I come down here piking, I move around. If I don't catch a pike in one area, I, I go and try somewhere else. If I use the top lures, the top lures and spinners, I'll chuck them in, I'll, re I'll, I'll retrieve them, and if I don't see any pike following following the, uh, the spinners or lures, I will... Uh, 
change the lure and lob another one in, chuck another one in. And if I still don't see any pike in the water chasing any of them lures, I might try a, um, a spoon or something on the bottom. And then failing that, I just move until I can actually see the pike. Um, previously to this, me catching this, I was on top lures I had nothing but round I could see the pike in the water I could actually see them but they weren't taking the lures so I thought you know what I'm gonna get the D-bomb out um, the good old desert storm D-bomb um, I've had some good fish on that in the past and I thought I'm gonna chuck that in and give it a go and bang in this video we get Hunter the trophy one of the trophy fish out of the canal here So I know I have got a video up where I'm just casting and catching, casting and catching, casting and catching pike, a trophy pike. It isn't like that anymore. Um, it's one of the reasons why I, I just wanted to do this little video of me catching Hunter here. You've got to have a lot more patience now catching the pike. I sometimes put the dead baits out, I'll put two dead baits out and I will do some spinning or I shall put two carp rods out do some carping and do some spinning and um, that's the way I uh, sometimes do it other than that I'm just walking around trying me luck trying to locate the trophy the trophy fish it's uh, it's not that easy nowadays particularly on mana which is primarily a carp lake so there's not many pike in there so it's a lot more difficult to catch a pike now on Manor Farm here we go let's take a look at him £32 6 ounces that's Hunter he fell to the D-bomb Desert Storm you want to have a quick look at the setup guys here's the setup if you like the video smack that like button don't forget to subscribe um try to, I, I only do this part-time not full-time youtuber so i try to do the videos you know as much as i can when i've got uh, a bit of free time so uh, thanks for watching chaps